In this video, we're going to be taking a look at some flow and performance data for this one and a half horsepower variable speed pool pump. The system is set up to operate on a single single two inch suction line, one and a half horsepower Pentair Superflow variable speed pump, 150 square foot Hayward cartridge filter. And again, we're going to be isolating through the two inch line and monitoring flow with this. This is actually an analog. This is the analog version of the flow meter that we're going to be using, but this one's adapt adapted with a digital controller and a remote interface that we'll be using over here to monitor the flow rate. Power supply, 240 volts. Let's go ahead and get started here. The pump's actually already running. They're very quiet at low RPM, so 500 RPM. And we're getting about 14 gallons per minute. And in the top right, you'll see the wattage. And that's just about 62 watts. So let's start dialing up these numbers. Seven hundred and fifty RPM. It's not very much. But look at that. We're already at twenty-two gallons per minute. Here's something that's interesting. Uh, a lot of salt water chlorinators require a, somewhere between fifteen to twenty gallons per minute in order to close the flow switch and operate. And so that's interesting. That even at seven hundred and fifty RPM. If this, if this system that we were testing right now had a salt system, it would probably be generating chlorine right now. So we're looking at about 91 and a half watts. Very little power, less than a 100 watt light bulb. One thousand RPM. Twenty seven gallons per minute. One hundred and thirty three watts. Thirty two gallons per minute, under one hundred and eighty nine watts. Thirty seven gallons per minute, two hundred and sixty three watts. Up to forty five gallons per minute, three hundred and seventy two watts. You start to see how the wattage jumps quite a bit as we go up in RPM here. Two thousand RPM. About 54 gallons per minute. Again with the wattage jump. 515. 
518. Call it 518. Sixty. I'm going to call it in the middle at 62 with the little bit of fluctuation there in the number. Just cresting over 700 watts. Five hundred RPM. That's seventy one gallons per minute. Nine hundred and thirty two watts. Seventy five gallons per minute, one point two kilowatts. So the decimal point moved there, so that's one thousand two hundred watts. Just over five amps, you can read on the left side there. Between 81 and 82 gallons per minute. 1.53 kilowatts, 1.52 kilowatts. So again, that's 1,530 watts. Just over 90 gallons per minute, 91 gallons per minute. 1.91 kilowatts, 1,910 watts. System pressure is under 10 PSI, just under 10. I would call that 10 PSI. Ninety seven, ninety eight gallons per minute. Two point two six, two point two seven kilowatts, just under ten amps of current draw, two thousand two hundred seventy watts. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.